Yo, what it do, my good motherfucker people? You dig? Today we here with a story time. You feel me? And if you read by the title, you already know this story time. Look, Pete, right? So Bistos, right? Bistos did a reaction about a year ago. You feel me? The Big Sad 1900, right? I ain't did a reaction on Big Sad 1900 since then. If y'all seen, I'm like 300 plus videos in. I didn't get a reaction to everybody, right? So boom. Let me tell you how this come about, right? So, when was this shit like? A couple of days ago. <clears throat> so, a little quick backstory on on how all this shit play out, right? So, look. A nigga been busy. I ain't been dropping videos, you feel me? I ain't even been at the crib. Like, I'm, I'm barely being at the crib like that for real. So, I can't even drop the videos. I can't even record the video because I ain't even been at the crib for real. So, look. I'm at... So, about... A week and some change ago, you feel me? I link up with one of my kin folks, you feel me? On some whole other type business. You know what I'm saying? We chopping it up, running game real quick. And I'm telling him like, yeah, nigga, you feel me? I ain't did videos in a minute because a nigga been OT. A nigga been out of town. A nigga been, uh, you feel me? A nigga been handling this business in and out. I barely even been at the crib to sit down real quick to even try to do the videos. You feel me? Because I got a whole bunch of other shit going on. You know what I'm saying? So he telling me like, yeah, you know, we shooting the shit on some other shit. All right, cool. So, like, a week go by, right? Like, a week pass. And uh, I hit Cuzzo up. This was probably, like, a couple days ago. Um, when was it? It was, it was, I forgot what day I hit him up. I can't exactly remember the exact date that I hit him up. But I hit him up, and I was like, yo, Kenfo, how, whoa, 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 whoa. You feel me? Shooting the shit on the business that we was handling. You feel me? I'm like, yo, how, he, yeah, you know, it's cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I bet. Boom. Next morning come. Right? Next morning come. This so it was Sunday. What's today? What's today? So today, November 21st. So it was November 17th. This was November 17th that I talked to him. Right? So boom, November 18th come. Boom. I'm in the morning time. I wake up. Right? So I'm zoned in. You feel me? Visualization, my future, and how things unfold and how everything working out the way it need to work out. How things is coming to me the way they need to. How everything is just happening the way the shit need to be happening. You feel me? So, boom. I'm deep into this shit, right? I'm deep into the visual visualization shit, right? I'm like, I'm like, I'm listening to some binary, uh, binary music. You know what I'm saying? If you know about it, you know about it. If you don't, you need to get in the tune with, your, with who you are. You feel me? So I'm listening to the music. The shit like three hours long, right? I'm like an hour and like 52 minutes into this shit, right? I'm not sleep. I'm like just zonk the fuck out, right? So boom. <clears throat> My phone starts vibrating, right? So I look over and I see the name and I'm like, damn, what cuz calling me about? You feel me? Cuz probably calling me about this business. You feel me? So boom. I answer the phone. I'm like, yo, what up, cuz? He like, shit, can't fuck what you got going. I'm like, shit, cool. And you feel me? Like, deep into it, you feel me? In a whole nother world, what's good with you? He like, cuz, you heard of Big Sad 1900? I'm like, yeah, I heard of Big Sad 1900 while I was up. He like, yeah, bro, this the only nigga I'm listening to right now. He was like, cuz, like, this nigga didn't put you on the album. I'm like, bro, what the fuck you mean he put me on the album? He like, cuz, look, listen, though. He, cause he, cause when he first hopped on the phone, he was like, "Look, I'm calling you on some whole other shit." So I'm like, "Cool." So then he tell me this, and I'm like, "What you mean he put me on the album? You feel me?" And he like, "Cause like, look, so yesterday I'm listening to this shit, right? And the first little joint come on, and I'm like, and I'm I'm chilling with my bitch. You feel me? I'm smoking, and I'm like, "Yo, this my cousin." And, and, and Shorty threw me off. Like, she completely threw me off because she like, man, this ain't your cousin. Da, 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 da. How out of all the people, this your cousin. Like, she like, nigga, this is my cousin. Like, I know my cousin voice when I hear my cousin voice. Like, this my cousin. So he running back and he like, bro, this him. And she like, nah, whoa, whoa. He like, so she threw me off. You feel me? Like, Shorty threw me completely off. But then mine, she like, you just high. Whoa, whoa. So I'm, so I'm in my head like, all right, maybe I am just high. He was like, cuz, but this morning I'm at work. Mind you, it's at, at this point in time, it's like it's like 11:30 in the morning. You feel me? No, it's not 11:30. It's probably like it's probably like 10:30. You feel me? Around 10:30, 10:45 in the morning, right? So in my mind, 
what I'm doing is, since I'm, I'm deep into my shit, I'm like, okay, after I'm done with this, I'm finna go hit the gym, work out, you feel me? Get my day started, get my meals, you feel me? Handle my business, so boom. He like, yeah, cuz, like, I ain't been hot since 6 a.m., but I'm listening to this shit, and I'm like, yo, this my cousin, you feel me? He was like, I'll run that motherfucker back. And I play it again, and I'm like, bro, this gotta be him. And I'll run it back again. He was like, cuz, I ran this shit back like five times, cuz, like, Bro, you on a nigga album. And I'm like, bro, like, what is, <laughs> what is you? <laughs> like, I'm still just like, what the fuck? You feel me? So he like, bro, go look this shit up. It's the new one that just came out. Like, this shit just came out. It's on the skip, bro. It's like 50 seconds in. So I'm like, all right, bro. Hold on real quick. Let me look this shit up. So I'm, I go on the little tones. You feel me? I, boom. I type it in. So I'm listening to this shit. And I'm like, you know, I get around like that 48 seconds. And I'm like. Yo, bro, really put me on the album. Like, bro, really put me on the album. Like, and I'm tripping because, like, like I said, I ain't y'all ain't seen no video. I ain't been able to drop no video, so I'm telling Ken folks this when I linked with him like a week and some change before. Like, yeah, I need to get back on that shit. You feel me? Like, and he like, cuz I told you it's you, like, bro. I don't know what the universe got working, you feel me? Because I know what we were chopping about it, and, and I know where you at with it, you feel me? But, bro, like, God trying to show you something, you feel me? Like, bro, niggas is watching your shit, you feel me? Now, mind you, in this same sense, this shit sparked something in my brain, you feel me? Because this ain't the only artist that actually peeped one of my jokes, you feel me? Like, I had Fredo Bang listen to one of my shit and repost it, comment on it, you feel me? I had, uh, I did the Millie's Blue Strips. He commented on the video, you feel me? But nah, the thing that was different about this one is because when I heard it, it was from a video that I dropped like a year ago. You feel me? So, cuz, like, that's what I'm saying. It's either, bro, like, they didn't heard you back then and saved it, or they went and peeped nah. Because, like, you got to think about it, right? Like, I'm still just like, because in my mind, I already know who I am. You feel me? I already know who I'm destined to be. I got, you feel me? It's a lot of shit. Like, if you know me, you know me. If you don't, you don't. But at the end of the day, you you do. You feel me? So it's like, I'm sitting here tripping, though, because I'm like, it's either motherfuckers heard it then and saved it for now, or motherfuckers just heard it now. You feel me? Because in the same sense, I'm like... This shit was already in the works because it's already out on iTunes and all that. So he already had this planned out. Kid felt like, that's what I'm saying. You feel me? Like, cuz you don't even know who listening to your shit. Like, bro, I be listening. And mind you, this is the thing when you're doing videos or when you're doing anything, right? It's like it's like planting a seed, right? You don't see the seed growing until that motherfucker come up out the ground. You feel me? But why that motherfucker in the ground, you got the roots and all this shit sprouting throughout the motherfucking soul. You feel me? So in the same sense of all of this, I'm I'm peeping, right? Because a lot of things is happening in my life. A lot of good shit is happening. Like, like Big Stokes, real life, blessed in a lot of areas. You feel me? Like, <clears throat> like I can't complain. You feel me? Like, through shit that I done been through, you feel me, this whole year, like... Shit is unfolding like, like crazy. You feel me? So when when I'm peeping this, and my mind is taking me to another place. So now I hop up. I'm like, bro, I'm finna go to the gym right now. You feel me? So now it's taking my mind elsewhere because I'm like, yo, like, yo, like, I, like niggas gotta get back on that shit because obviously it's something. You feel me? He like, cause like niggas in AZ all the way, bro. This nigga the biggest artist right now in LA, and like, bro, he picked you. Out of all people, he picked you. Out of all people in the world, bro. Like, like, let's let's kick back and let that sink in right quick. Like, you feel me? Like, for real, like, Big Stokes, the same, the same motherfucker you watching right now. Out of all the people in the world, he decided to take Big Stokes' clip from a video from a year ago and put it on an album that's. That came out a year and some change later. How many songs he didn't drop since then? How many mixtapes or albums he didn't drop since then? But out of nowhere, out of this specific one, he decided to put Big Stokes on there. Now, mind you, it was some other individuals on there. You feel me? It's probably like three other individuals on there. But when you think about that, that's three or four people out of hundreds and millions of people in the whole world. 
right? So I'm peeping this, and cuz like, I don't know what you doing, Kenfo. But don't stop doing it. You feel me? Because you, nigga, and so in my mind, I already know this, though. You feel me? I already know I'm different. You know what I'm saying? I already know I'm chosen. And everybody who know me know this same motherfucking thing. Like, everybody know this. You feel me? The energy that propels out of my body is different than the average individual. You feel me? Like, it's not one person in my whole entire life. Even if they, even if they not cool with me no more, even if they, we, we was together and we not together, even if we was homies and we not homies, whatever the case may be, they cannot say I didn't affect their life in the most positive way. No matter what ups and downs may come, I affected their life in a way more positive way than anything else possible. You feel me? So you can run from the truth, but the truth is undisputed. R.P. Draco. But the truth is undisputed. You can't hide like you can't. You can't. Like God didn't bless you to have this opportunity to not only be watching me if you're watching me, but to have the opportunity to have access to me. And you don't realize it because we didn't got into this world where everything is just so normal that you think everybody normal. But motherfuckers who know me know the shit is, is supernatural with me. You feel me? Like the shit supernatural with me. So in this same sense of me doing this video, nigga talking about like, cuzzo like, bro, you over here talking about you ain't dropped no videos and this guy smacking your ass in the face. Like, bro, what is you doing? You feel me? Like, and it's not like I, like I said, it's not like other areas of my life ain't blossoming, blossoming. You know what I'm saying? Like it's blossoming big time. You know what I'm saying? But in the same sense, it's like, this right here blossoming too. And this right here forever. So think about that. If he heard this a year ago, that means that they say that. But if you heard it recently, that means that they went to search that. Now look, the video, you could go look the video up on my channel. You know what I'm saying? I'll put it in this shit. But you can look the videos up in my channel. Them motherfuckers ain't even got a thousand views on it. You feel me? So that, that tells you something different. That the video... Was dropped a year ago, but the video don't even got thousands of views on that motherfucker. That motherfucker probably don't even have over 500 views on that bitch. You feel me? But somehow, whatever I said is in there. So, with that being said, this is this is an accomplishment for Big Stokes, but it's also an accomplishment for those who believe in me and those who support what I got going on and everything that I do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't live my life in no hate. I don't live my life with no evil. You feel me? Like, I love everybody that fuck with me. Even if you stop fucking with me or don't fuck with me, I still love you. It ain't no bad blood. My hands is open to you. You feel me? At any present time, you can pick up the phone. You got my number. You know that I'm coming running like off rip. It's just like that. Because the way I am and who I am, I don't have to be like nothing else. I don't have to. You walk away. I don't have to go around here doing that. You feel me? If we not cool no more, I don't have to run around here doing that. You may do it. And you gonna do it. But you know what you're doing is really fighting the fact and fighting the truth of what's really going on and being mishandled in the situation. You fumbled the rock. You turned over the ball. You feel me? It was a strikeout. You playing games. So with that being said, this is what I'm saying. Like, And, and I say all of that to say this because this is the thing. I'm going to put the... uh. I'm going to put the shit right here in the description so that way you can go peep it if you want to peep it. Or I'm going to put the picture in this video so that way you can peep it and you'll know what song it is so that way you can go listen to it if you fuck me. If you don't, you don't. Whatever the case may be. You feel me? Small things to a giant. This is what I'm saying. No matter how small it is, it's still major. So I'm going to tell you this if you're watching this and you do YouTube or you're watching this and you're doing whatever you're doing. Keep doing what you're doing, bro. A, 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 a little baby. Keep doing what you're doing. Life gonna happen. Shit gonna happen. Shit not gonna always go the way you plan it to go. But it's universally gonna go the way that it need to go to show you what you need to be on. You feel me? Let them. That's, that's what I learned in 2024. Let them. You feel me? Keep being a honey. Keep being solid. Keep being divine. Keep being blessed. Keep being happy. Keep being spiritually. You feel me? Keep elevating your mind. Keep elevating your body. Keep elevating your life. Keep doing everything that has gotten you to be the greatest version of yourself. And let them do what they do. 
Let them people talk down on you. Let them people try to crucify you. You feel me? Let them people try to make it seem like you wasted all of their time. Let them do it, bro. Just let them do it and bless them. Pray for them. Believe that they can have discernment and get up out of that nonsense that they in. Because all that is is a parasite that's in their brain that's altering the way they think about life. You feel me? When you live with love and you live with God on your side, things always going to happen for you. You always going to be blessed. So in that sense, with this right here, this was a blessing. This was a big one. I'm proud of Big Stokes. You feel me? And I hope you proud of Big Stokes too. And Big Sad 1900, I'm fucking with you. I fuck with it. I vibe with it. I appreciate you for that. That's worldwide for the rest of life. I done made that and I didn't even know that. But I appreciate that. You feel me? So in the same sense, man, I'm fucking with all this. This is a little small story. Like I said, this right here, put another battery in my back and let me know what's going on. I appreciate y'all. I'm fucking with y'all. Go check out all my work. Like I said, I got 300 plus videos on my page and we're going to be dropping some more videos and keeping this shit going. And we just going to keep riding and riding and riding and riding and riding. Keep handling your business. Keep doing what you're doing. I appreciate you. I love you. I care about what you got going on. Hit that comment section. Let me know what's cracking. You feel me? I fuck with you. And this here be stoked. Sign on Big Stokes reactions. You did.